Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. We are heading to Trader Joe's and doing a little grocery shopping and I wanted to share my grocery haul with you. I'm back from Trader Joe's. I'm gonna go ahead and get all my groceries unloaded and show you what I got. I didn't get too much. I spent a little over $100, $107. And when I go to Trader Joe's, I'm not getting our everyday grocery items. I'm getting just certain items that I like to buy at Trader Joe's. How cute is this cherry bag? I saw it at Home Goods the other day and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. I love cherries. I live in Michigan. We're known for cherries. It's so cute. So I had to get it for my groceries. This is everything that I got on our Trader Joe's shopping trip. It isn't too much, but let's get into the haul. We'll start down here. I got some of the organic cashew unsweetened yogurt. I love this yogurt. This is a must buy every time I go to Trader Joe's. I buy this yogurt every time I go to Trader Joe's. It's so good if you have a dairy allergy and you are looking for an unsweetened yogurt. This is so good. And my little one loves it too, which I like because it isn't sweetened. Franklin also got some stickers. These are the July 4th stickers. They're super cute. He always loves getting stickers there. I needed some garlic. I got a shallot. They had purple cauliflower, so I went ahead and picked that up. I probably will just end up roasting that in the oven. That sounds really good. And then I got a bunch of bananas. I like this size bananas for Franklin because they're a little bit smaller and he'll eat the whole thing. I can't have dairy, so I really like their dairy-free vegan cheeses at Trader Joe's. And I'm so sad that they stopped carrying their vegan feta, which was really good. I got two bags of the dairy-free shredded Parmesan cheese. This is really good. This is one of my favorite vegan cheeses that I've had. I actually have not tried their mozzarella cheese, which really surprises me. So I went ahead and got that because we're going to make pizzas this week. We're going to do like non-pizzas. So if you want to see how I'm going to make those, be sure to subscribe to my channel because I will be doing a video on that. Then after that, some of the vegan pepperoni. Franklin really loves this pepperoni too. So I got that to make like a vegan pepperoni pizza. I also got some tofu. I really like this high protein, super firm tofu. You really don't need to press it. It's great. Then I got some arugula and then two bags of spinach for a couple recipes I'm going to make for dinner this week. And then I got some of the vegan kale, cashew, and basil pesto. This is so good. This vegan basil pesto is a must buy. I buy this every time I go to Trader Joe's. It is so good. I think I'm also going to do a pesto pizza. That sounds really good. And I got some roasted garlic hummus and then I got the garlic spread dip. And then I also got the pizza sauce for the pizzas. I've never actually had this pizza sauce before from Trader Joe's, so I'm excited to give that a try. And this was in the refrigerated section. Now for some new items, I didn't pick up all of the recent new items that they have at Trader Joe's just because I just don't need everything all at once. But I did get the strawberries and cream pancake and waffle mix. This does have milk in it, and so I can't have it, but I thought Franklin would really love it. So I went ahead and got this for him because we have so many different waffle makers. <laughs> So we got that, and then this is new, the peanut butter pillows. So both Franklin and I love peanut butter. These pizza crackers are also new. I'm very intrigued by these. I don't know how they're gonna be, but I think that they're a hard cracker, and they are seasoned. And then I got two things of their shelf-stable gnocchi for a recipe this week for dinner. And this coffee is also new, the Kenya coffee. I love trying their small lot coffees when they have them. And so I went ahead and got that. And it is a whole bean, so you do have to grind it. And I have a coffee grinder, and I grind my coffee beans every morning, and I just think it's so much better. So I went ahead and picked that up to try. And I also got some crystallized ginger to have on hand. I want to make a cake recipe that uses candied ginger, so I went ahead and picked it up since I was there. I'm not sure when I'm going to make the cake, but I thought I better have this on hand. For the frozen items, I got a bag of the frozen peas. I love having frozen peas in the freezer. And then I got a bag of frozen mango chunks. I want to make a mango crumble this week for a sweet treat um, for dessert one night. So I went ahead and just got the frozen mango chunks. And then, then I also picked up these oat non-dairy frozen dessert sandwiches. They're vanilla. I have had these in the past and I remember really liking them. So I went ahead and picked this out. Well, Franklin wanted to get a frozen treat. So I went ahead and picked something that both him and I could have. So we got that. And then I also got some of the vanilla bean oat frozen ice cream not dairy to go on that mango crumble because it sounds really good this wine was also new and i needed that for a recipe i needed some white wine so i went ahead and just got that since it was new and to try i also got the fully cooked falafel that's in the freezer section because i'm going to be making a falafel sandwich this week for lunch or dinner so i got that and i'm going to put it with 
arugula bread with naan bread or a pita and then with this garlic spread on top i think that sounds so good so i went ahead and got that i also got two of the dill pickle mustards i love this mustard it is so good i buy it every season it is a seasonal item so i went ahead and got two and then i needed some cinnamon and then i also needed some ground cloves i haven't seen this before at my trader joe so i'm not sure if it's new but this thai peanut sauce i thought it looked really good so i went ahead and got that maybe we'll make like a tofu veggie stir fry and serve that over rice one night for dinner and then i just got a can of chickpeas a can of the refried beans and then i needed dish soap so that is everything that i got at trader joe's this week thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video